Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we will make exam result in PDF format at user side, in this PHP based online exam system, so user can download exam result, and he or she can take out print of result. In previous part, we have make particular user exam result, and display on web page, by using PHP script, but in this part, we want to make exam result PDF format. For this here, we will use DOM PDF library for make PDF document in PHP, first we have go to view exam.php file. And here we want to link, so by click on link, we can view exam result in PDF format, for this here we have write anchor tag, with ref is equal to, PDF exam result dot PHP file name, with question mark code variable is equal to, echo statement, with dollar get code variable value, by click on this link, user can get exam result in PDF format. Now we have go to PDF exam result dot PHP file, and here we have write include statement with master folder name slash examination dot PHP file. Here we have include this examination class. After this, we have write require one statement, with class folder name slash pdf dot php file, this code will include dom pdf class library in this file. First want to make object of examination class, so here we have write dollar exam variable is equal to, new examination class, by using this object we can call this examination method. Now we have write, if statement, and under condition, we have write is set function, with dollar get code variable, if this variable value is set, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar exam id variable is equal to, dollar exam object with get exam id method with dollar get code variable value this method will return exam id based on value of dollar get code variable value after getting exam id now we have write dollar exam object with query variable is equal to select star from question table inner join user exam question answer table on user exam question answer table dot question id is equal to question table dot question id in where condition we have write question table dot online exam id is equal tom dollar exam id variable value and user exam question answer table dot user id is equal to dollar session user id variable value this select query will return particular user exam details like question and their answer data now we have write dollar result variable value is equal to dollar exam object with query result method this method will run above query and return query execution result after this we have write dollar output variable is equal to this html code this code will make html table with column like question title your answer correct answer, result and marks. Below this table, we have write dollar total mark variable is equal to zero. For fetch data from dollar result variable, 
here we have right for each loop, and under condition, we have right dollar result variable, as dollar row variable. Under this loop, we have right, dollar exam object, with query variable is equal to, select star from option table, and in where condition, we have right question ID is equal to, dollar row question ID variable value, this query will return option details of particular question. Below this query, we have right dollar sub result variable is equal to, dollar exam object with query result method, this method will return query execution result. Now we have define three variable like dollar user answer is equal to blank value, dollar original answer variable is equal to blank value, and dollar question result variable is equal to blank value. After this, we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar row marks variable value is equal to zero, if this condition true, that means user has not attend particular question. So under this block, we have write dollar question result variable is equal to, text like not attend. Same way, we have again write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar row marks variable value is greater than zero, if this condition true, that means user has give right answer of particular question. So under this block, we have write dollar question result variable is equal to, text like write. And for check wrong answer, here we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar marks variable value, is less than zero, if this condition true, that means user has give wrong answer. Under this block, we have write dollar question result variable is equal to wrong. So, it will store all question result detail in this variable. Now we have write output variable, and in this we have append this HTML code, and in first column we want to print, question title details, so here we have write dollar row question title variable. After this, we have write for each loop, and under condition, we have write, dollar sub result variable as dollar sub row variable. Under this loop, we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar sub row option number variable value is equal to, dollar row user answer option variable value, if this condition true, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar user answer variable value is equal to, dollar sub row option title variable value. Here we have store option title, which has been select by user as an answer of question. Now, for get question correct answer, here we have write if statement, and under condition, we have write dollar sub row option number variable value, is equal to dollar row answer option variable value. Under this block, we have write dollar original answer variable is equal to, dollar sub row option title variable value, here we have store question correct answer, under this dollar original answer variable. Now, 
we have write dollar output variable, and in this we have append this HTML code. So, here we want to display answer, which has been select by user, so here we have write dollar user answer variable. After this, in next column we want to display question original answer, so here we have write dollar original answer variable value. Now in this table column, we want to display user has select right answer, or wrong answer or not attend particular question, for this here we have write dollar question result variable value. In last table column, we want to display marks of particular question, for this here, we have write dollar row marks variable value. It will print exam all question details in this table in HTML format. Now we want to get total marks details, so here we have write dollar exam object with query variable is equal to, select some function with marks table column as total, from user exam question answer table. Where user ID is equal to, dollar session user ID variable value, and exam ID is equal to, dollar exam ID variable value, this query will return total marks of exam. Below this query, we have write dollar marks result variable is equal to, dollar exam object with, query result method, this method will return query execution result. For get data from dollar marks result variable, here we have write, for each loop and under condition, we have write dollar marks result variable as dollar row variable. Under this loop, first we have paste this HTML code, for display total marks details. And for print total marks details from dollar marks result variable, so here we have write dollar row total marks variable, it will print how many marks has been gained by particular user in online exam. So here we have store exam result in HTML format, in this dollar output variable, now we want to make PDF document from this HTML data. So here we have write dollar PDF variable is equal to new PDF function. Here we have make object of DOM PDF library, which we have store under this class folder. Below this, we have write dollar object with set paper method, with argument like letter and landscape. This method will set the paper size and orientation. After this, we have write dollar file name variable is equal to exam result dot PDF. Here we store PDF file name under this variable. Now we have write dollar PDF object with load HTML method and under this we have write dollar output variable html with load html which we have store under dollar output variable after this we have write dollar pdf object with render method this method will make pdf document from html code and lastly we have write dollar pdf object with stream method with two argument. In first argument we have write dollar file name variable and second argument. We have write array with key attachment set to false. It will open PDF document in browser so user can view exam result in PDF format in browser.
So here our code is ready for display online exam result in PDF format at user side, so we have saved this code, and check output in browser. Friends, here we have login at user side, and here we can see exam result on web page, now first we have refresh web page. After refresh of web page, here we can see one button has been appear on web page, with text PDF. So we have click on this button. After click on button, here we can see page has been redirect in browser, and in browser we can see PDF document has been open. This PDF document is the exam result of particular user, and here user can exam result for each question, which is right answer, which is wrong answer, how many marks he or she get in each question. User can see total marks of exam also in this PDF document, so in this part, we have see how to see exam result in PDF format, in next part of this online examination system, we will go to admin side, and make exam result for all user. If you have some suggestion regarding this PHP based online examination system, you can comment in comment box. If you want to learn this system, Please stay connected with us.